cool, it's grand. It's recording now. Okay. So let's get started. Let's start up a new save. There hasn't been a patch since 102, right? Hi, YouTube, sub to my old. Yeah, do sub to my old YouTube if you're not. You probably are already. Okay, no errors. <laughs> That's good. Since I did this at like 3 a.m., I was expecting all the errors. Uh, not, not that I know, not that you know what. Uh, we're gonna call this Union. Please push Rusev. That was one of the guys that I almost forgot to put in the company as well. Like, he was the last guy I put in. Because I just forgot he got released. It's such a weird concept to me, releasing Rusev, that I just forgot about it. I'm digging this playlist. Right, we're doing the killing the business mod. Okay, so wrestling is killing professional wrestling. There, I said it. It may sound ludicrous, but it's true. It's driven all the casual fans away in their droves and now all that's left. Hello, hello, Luke. All that's left is the hardcore fan base who would choose to watch Raw over going out with their girlfriend. Wrestling has never been a cool thing to watch because it's guys pretending to hurt each other in their underwear. However, when you add soap opera elements to it, a kick-ass attitude and stars that look larger than life, then it doesn't only become cool, it becomes cutting edge. It becomes a part of pop culture. It defines an entire generation. The biggest problem with wrestling today is how they wrestle. They can't sell a thing, so instead they attempt to outdo one another with crazy stunts like there's some gymnastics on speed. It looks ridiculous, it's shortening careers and it needs to stop. The circus died out a long time ago due to the same antics becoming stale and the same is happening with wrestling. No one is talking about wrestling anymore because there's nothing to talk about. I don't care how many somersaults Ricochet can do or how many backflips the Young Bucks can pull off, it means nothing. Says James Klonowski. He said this in December 2019. I do not know who James Konowski is, but apparently he said this. So this is the, 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 the killing the business mod. Agree or disagree, how are you going to launch wrestling into the newest decade? One thing is for certain, only time will tell. God, I love these pictures, they're amazing. We're not using any of these lads. The James Klon I know, it's the James Klonowski. You may remember him from such quotes as this one that I just read. We are going to go after this guy. See, current honors, he is the owner and booker of Union. Uh, user talents, I haven't looked at this. Is this the same thing as TW2016, are the same ones? Oh, there's a few new ones, okay. Okay, so Lucky Dip and Steady Hand, I believe they're the new ones. Okay, that's random. And steady hand. Uh, there's a new one. So ju just lucky dip. Ah, uh, it's random. Okay, that's interesting. I'm I'm I like going for jack of all trades because I'm boring to be honest. Oh, there's a new talent level. Negotiating. Oh, it's this one. What is this? What is this? Okay, hold on. This doesn't. Okay, what do they. Fuck. Uh. What does it mean? Oh, hello, right about wrestling. I'm good, how are you? How are you doing? Well, what's Silver Tongue? Is this like. Persuading wrestlers to do certain things, like to lose weight or to gain weight or to lose to someone? Is that, is that what, what that's about? I'm assuming that's what that's about. Persuading people. Okay. Okay. Makes sense. Okay. So we're going to play as Kurt Angle. Let's remove the avatars. Uh, we're going to start as the union. This is the, the killing the business mod. I've got all the killing the business graphics, I believe. If I'm wrong, I'll, I'll correct that. Uh, kind of bugs me that this one isn't in this template, but that's something that I'll fix at some point, maybe. When, when, when I, um... When I can be bothered. And this is Union. 
we are gonna take down the WWE with Union. If I found the same James Klonowski who wrote that quote, he said a month ago on Twitter, Vince Russo is the most underrated and misunderstood man in pro wrestling. Yeah, it sounds like the same guy, to be honest, Luke. It, it sounds like those two quotes are from the same person. It definitely sounds that way. What a, um, what a genius. What a wrestling genius. He's, a, he's certainly a person. Mm-hmm. And if you can't say anything nice, look at this. Look at this beautiful office after the redesign. Oh, so much better. It's so much better. Like, good job. Oh, I'm not up to standards. The best is on Redbubble with a watermark. I'll find a way to to cut through the um, the logo in this one. But thanks to the who. Also, hi. Uh, let's just upgrade this. Uh, this hurts me. I thought I had the bare minimum, but I didn't. I was ooh, two off. Three off? Okay. Jesus. Okay. Aiden English doesn't have a defined role on the roster. Let's fix that. That's not how you fix that. There we go. He's a wrestler. Is that replicating it for you? Wait, if you'd like to give it a shot, I'd I'd be I'd be very appreciative of it, Mild. Also more like James Clownowski, I just saw that nice. <laughs> okay, so we have Aiden English, Billy Kidman, Brian Myers, Cash Wheeler. Stupid name. Chris Hero, best wrestler in the world. You can download their templates for the Killing the Business graphic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm saying the uh, the logo itself, the the union one. Yeah, the templates I, I can download the, it's on the GDS forums, but thank you. Uh, Finley, uh, Dax Harwood, Diana Perrazzo, Drew Gulak. I updated it last night. Okay, uh, no worries, thank you. Right vision. Um, uh, what am I doing? Oh, Epico, Eric Young, Eric Rowan. I'll have to rename this guy. Ethan Carter the Third, Gregory Helms, Heath Miller, Joe Hennig, Carl Anderson, Killer Kelly, Kurt Angle and Storm, Noe Jose, who is under his real name here. Uh, Leo Rush, Luke Gallows, Maria Canales, Zach Ryder, Mike Bennett, Mike Kyoda, Mike Rotunda, Miro. Uh, MJ, <coughs> MJ Jenkins, Rachel Ellering, Rockstar Spud, Sarah Stock, Scott Armstrong, Serena Deeb, Sean Devari, and Tenado Conti. Um, feel like I'm forgetting something. Oh, uh, some of the guys that were released are not in this mod, um, or I couldn't find them. Uh, let me just, for the hell of it. Yeah, see? And that reminds me, I forgot someone. Not gonna poach Shauna. Uh, that's what I was gonna get into. Right, also forgot about that. Conti was rad. Yeah, Conti was super rad. She was cool. And I'm, I'm glad she's sticking to wrestling in the Indies after uh, this whole thing's done. Because I was quite looking forward to seeing more of her. Um, so, the story for Union. Union is the group of wrestlers that WWE let go. Uh, this year uh, Which is why I'm currently lingering on Cain Velasquez's uh, thingamabopper um, ooh, Per month? No, fuck off. You're, you're getting paid per show cuz Three year, okay 1300 fine. That's fine um, We're going to sign everybody that WWE released in 2020 if I forgot anybody I believe I signed everybody but I, if I forgot anybody let me know um, I could sign Kathy Kelly to do like an announcing gig I believe uh, Gulak he's on the roster uh, big union man David Starr no he was the uh, he was not released by WWE <laughs> Um. Ah, no, her announcing is terrible. Damn. Because I, I do believe I have to have announcers and I don't have them yet. So I have to check. Uh. 
have to check for available announcers can work in USA. Uh, to hire. Who can we sign as an announcer? He's very pro-union. Yes. Yes, he is. But he is not a WWE release. The point here is uh, giving all these releases a second chance. Uh, I don't even know who this guy is. Uh, oh, I could do Mike Tanay. I could sign Mike Tanay. He was good. Is he retired? He's not. I could sign him. How's his announcing? Okay, okay. I'm gonna sign Tanay. I'm gonna pay him per show. Uh, you are going to be exclusively an announcer. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. 500 for sure. That's f for sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I have a feeling that we're going to have to let some road agents go because road agents in this game get paid a lot more than they used to. So I can't just stack up on them. So I'm probably going to have to let some go. They technically released him in 2001 because they never hired. That's true. He is a WWE release. Technically. And that's the best kind of right. Technically right. Uh, who can we sign? Oh, oh, I see somebody. Is it? Oh, Alex Riley. I don't know if he's in the mod. What's his name? Kevin Kiley or Alex Riley? Because some of these are under their WWE name. Uh, what are you? Color commentator, yeah? Primarily as a color commentator. Okay. How about Stu Bennett? Mark Madden. I am not signing Cornette. Not now, not ever. Uh-uh. Not happening. Cornette is not going to get a paycheck. Uh-uh. Uh, 500. You're going to be exclusively a color commentator. Excited for the 2013 mod so I can push Barrett to the moon. Dude, he was, he had so much potential. I'm, I'm, I am mad that they never realized his potential in the WWE. 600, why do you want 600? Okay, well, apparently Stu Bennett's worth more than Mike Tanay. Wait, player commentator? You. Yep. Uh, Bruce, I'm not signing. Bruce. Fuck off. Okay, yeah, that, that should do it. That should do it for announcers, yeah. Uh, where am I going now? Uh, can uh, is there a way to check like ideal roster that? Because you can do that when you're making the company and the editor, but is there a, a way to check it? When they ask for specific demand, you can press the button that says set the last demand. Ooh. Well, that's a new thing. On the office screen. It's right there. Oh my god. Okay, this is one of those things, but I'm not seeing it. Where is it? The text on the left. I don't see it. I genuinely don't see it. What <laughs> what's happening? It's in text instead of being a button. Oh, never mind. Never mind. I saw that. Okay, cool. Bloody grenade. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Thank you. I'm blind. Um, Maria Canales is a manager without any clients. Let's fix that. Uh, where's Mike Bennett? There we go. Uh, there we go, manager. Maria Canales. There we go. Yeah. Put that in an ultimate fails compilation. I never fail. I just take longer to succeed. That's how it works. Right. So we have 
a roster. Okay, let's see if anybody will give us a TV show. I feel like that's only natural for us to do that. This is not how you do that, apparently. Oh my god. I have no idea what I'm doing in this in this game. I'm still learning all this stuff. Okay, we'll negotiate. Yes. Okay, a lot of people want to negotiate. Cool. Um Okay, so that's Okay, I want I want Oh gosh. What? What is this? <laughs> Okay, so terrestrial pay-per-view, what? Hold on. I don't need to read this. Where's where's broadcasting? Where's... Ah! I have no idea where to find... Ro okay. Can anybody explain to me what terrestrial, cable, and internet mean? And what they are different... So I, c I can tell the difference between pay-per-view, commercial free air, and subscription, which is how it used to work just those four but what's the difference between terrestrial cable and internet what uh, what's the advantage what's the pros what's the cons of each one because i have no idea oh bleacher report look at that uh, Oh, we could go on Cablevision for some USA pay-per-view. Okay, the rest is available to everyone. Cable is a smaller potential audience, and internet is a lot of potential viewers. Yeah, I had no, I had no idea. Um, either, uh, Luke. Look, DirecTV. Look, that gives me America, Canada, and Mexico for a cable base pay-per-view provider but apparently cable is not as good as terrestrial or internet right that's what I'm learning from from miles suggestion so not cable so if I want to go for a, like a, a pay-per-view thing cable is the best cable is the best cable what it, cable is the best what do you mean but smaller potential audience though you said terrestrial is available to everyone, cable is a smaller potential audience, and internet is a lot of potential viewers. So cable pay-per-view? Or cable, cable pay-per-view for the events, and cable commercial for TV shows? Right, I'm, I'm, uh, wait, direct if you're in demand, I'm going to go for this, cause there's one that, that gives me like huge, uh, coverage in America, but this one gives me America, Canada, and Mexico, which like crosses three countries off the list immediately. Oh, let's take a free internet and I find something better. Hold on. Oh, well, internet gives me like everything medium though internet pay-per-view there's no internet commercial but internet pay-per-view gives, gives me like a lot oh what's that free to air oh but free to air gives me nothing free to air gives me like that's good for like a b show like well like aw dark or i don't know how nwa is profiting off of that but Hmm. How about subscription? Oh, oh, we can go on Twitch. We can be live on Twitch. How the hell is a Twitch only America and Canada? How's that work then? Okay, okay, maybe, maybe not internet subscription, but probably internet pay per view. For, for. Yeah, live on Twitch will never catch on. Okay, we can go, we can go, <laughs> no Twitch in Europe, stream over. I'm not even streaming, I'm just talking to myself. Okay, let's, let's do events with Fight TV. I feel like that's the best way to do it. 
Uh, can I get more money? Can I get prime time and more money? Yeah, yeah. I guess it makes sense not to overpower it. Put RVD on Twitch, that'll make money. Okay, they don't want to give me that time slot. But they will give me late night. They would not pay... They would not pay for any... They would not pay anything per show. And Union would not pay anything per show. They're not asking for exclusive rights. Cool. That's neat. Okay, yeah, that's that's probably the best that I can do. Up, oh, they're not gonna do 45, but they will do 40. They will do 40, that's cool. I think 40's good. Considering it's like worldwide, I think 40's good. How about that? Cool. So we have our our pay-per-view broadcaster that's on Fi TV, okay. And that means I can get another deal for it, which is cool. Very true. Let's try and get some TV deals. Not what I meant to do, is it? Wait, no, it is. Okay. So we have KDOC LA, Puerto Rico and, and LA. Okay, so cable to commercial, like, oh, no, that's terrestrial. What am I saying? That's not cable. As long as it's not one with exclusivity, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay, cable commercial, here we go. That's the one I meant. Medium, okay, this is big. Fox Sports and FX. Okay, oh, but this one gives me like, oh, Paramount, get, oh, look at that. Gives me Canada as well. Okay, okay, I'm digging it. What do you give me? Just in Canada, but very small. Okay, we can go. <laughs> Destination America though Okay, we can go for one of the big like FX and Fox Sports They'll probably because it's for a TV show they'll probably ask for exclusivity So maybe it's not worth it to go for this and to rather go for this one Paramount You know what I mean Could be on straight after Mountain Monsters <laughs> But I don't know, because this one's medium. FX is big. Oh, so is USA and and, uh, and Fox Sports. I like, gone USA, like like uh, SmackDown is. No, wait, SmackDown's on Fox. Raw is on USA, right? I think. I th yeah, I, th I think it's more... Yeah, this should be better, right? Because it it allows me to expand into Canada more easily. It isn't exclusive for that region, so get exclusives for each area. Let's see if there is an exclusive for Canada. No, there's not an exclusive for Canada, though. There's like an exclusive for... I want to take a terrestrial. Oh, that's, that's something. All right. That's a good suggestion, uh, the who. Okay. So they're against wrestling. We could go for one of these for Canada and then go for cable commercial for for USA to get the big the big one. You know? Maybe TLN. TLN's good, right? Medium. Oh, these guys air... Yeah, TLN. Let's go for TLN. Right, commercial terrestrial for... I need to make a TV show. I forgot about that. Uh, add new TV show. Do we have any any cool logos? Don't forget all the other... Yeah, yeah, yeah. I gotta go area to area. Oh, look at this. Adrenaline. Anarchy Reigns. Fusion. Heat. Hello, cat. Rage. Redemption. Oh, Redemption's good for this, yeah?
Good for redemption. No, that's good. That's good for like an event. Maybe I'll just go union. Just call it union. You know. Just call it union. Union, hello cat. What? Oh, because I said hello cat. Dang it. Union. Uh. Union Live <clears throat> Nothing happened Tape multiple shows. I forgot that was a feature. Okay, so we're not going to do Mondays because that's Raw. And we're not going to do Wednesdays because that's AEW and NXT. And we're not going to do Fridays because that's SmackDown. So that leaves us with Tuesdays and Thursdays. Four weeks of TV at, <laughs> at once. Let's roll. Let's do it. Nope, nope. Let's not do that. Okay, we're just gonna do one hour of TV. What? Why is there an alternative? Oh shit! Look at that. Okay. We're not numbering them. It's just name. Showdown. Ooh no. Untouchable. No. Sensation. No. Game time. Dominance on your TV. Oh, what the fuck? Can you. Mild, could you please uh, 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 ban that? Thank you. Good friend. Good mod. Nobody trying to get bots in here. Okay, Union Live. Yeah, one one hour should be good. One show at a time. Let's do Thursdays. Yeah, Thursdays is good, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Should be good. Okay. Uh, new deal for Union Live. A financial incentive. The hell's wrong with you? Oh, they want exclusive rights. No, 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 no. We're not doing. We're not doing TLN. Okay, we're not doing TLN. That's one off the list. I didn't ban him because I really wanted to be famous. <laughs> I mean, it's fair. Like, I'm gonna memorize that that username. Just so I can go up to that guy and whisper him, hey, I want to be famous. Just let me know how, how I can buy, you know, popularity. Yeah, just, just, no, no, I, I believe that's like exclusive rights everywhere, no? <laughs> the band, could we getting famous? Yeah, we're getting famous. Okay, Indian Live. Okay, they don't want to give me that time slot. That's fine. Okay, 25 is what they'll give me. Oh, thanks for the host, Peps. Brigad. <laughs> okay. In all regions which they have coverage. See, that's the difference. These guys specifically say they want exclusive rights to the footage. How's it going? Were you streaming? If you were, I didn't notice. How'd it go if you were? Uh, they won't accept any deal unless they have exclusive rights to the footage in all regions in which they have coverage. So the, the other guys didn't say in which we have coverage, they just wanted exclusivity. I believe. 
Well, but I'll check. Cause now, cause now I want to know. Not yet. Chat, say hi to Peps, please. Be nice. Oh, you know what? You're absolutely right, uh, Miles. It absolutely was just the region. Well, going back to to these lads then. Okay, it's gonna be a late night show for one year. The purpose of this deal is that that doesn't matter. We're not gonna go head to head with any other TV shows, which is cool. You're right, vindication. Get those mildly three vindications in the chat. Um. Okay, so you guys can can have yeah. Okay, cool. And now move over to cable commercial in USA into FX and we negotiate for Union Live. 30% late night. USA, okay. So now we're on we're we're, we're on USA TVs as well. Cool. Let's go into Mexico now. A uh, terrestrial commercial. Okay, that's Azteca, medium, medium, medium. All of them are medium. Okay, so they're airing SmackDown. So we're not gonna go to the same one. They're airing Raw. We're not gonna go to the same one as them. We're gonna go somewhere else. Either Televisa or Imagen Televisión. Probably Imagen. Okay, uh, give me more money. Free money. Okay, cool, 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 cool. We're on Imagen. Wait. For Union Live, okay, yeah. Okay, now we have Union Live in Mexico. Let's go into the British Isles. They're airing explosion. Oh, Channel 5 will air me. Cool. They won't. Why won't they air me then? I thought they were... Oh, because they already air explosions. Is that it? They only won one TV show? Wrestling TV show? Is that it? There are no deals to adjust. Maximum broadcast slots reached. Okay. They can only do one show, apparently. Front runner it is then. Union Live. Give me money. Okay. Okay, late night show. Click on the requirements. Uh channel five. How do uh, how do? I don't know how how do. How do help? How click on requirements on the text? Okay. Uh, uh. Yeah, I have all of this. I believe it says like maximum broadcast slots reach right here, because I but apparently they can only air one wrestling TV show. I don't know. And late night, here we go. We're on Front Runner. Do you know this channel, Mild? Can you tell me anything about it? Is this a bad channel to be on? Did I just make a mistake? Is what I'm trying to find out, basically. Medium. Any huge? Any big? Nope. Okay. Uh. Gawara, oh, we could go for Gawara, that airs uh, all, uh, all Japan, yeah. This one's high risk, I guess, I'll, I'll just go for this one. Uh, Gifu. Generic sports channel? Gotcha. We have plenty of those here, as well. 25%, late night. Cool. 
and for Europe now. Well, how many regions in Europe? Is that a, is this all Sport TV? Yeah, this is all. Yeah, five five regions for Europe. There are more. Is that so? One, two, three, four. Okay, so what's missing here? Bonjour, tout bien. If you can speak in English, please. Thank you. How's it going, by the way? Okay, so Western Europe, Iberia, Southern Mediterranean, Southern Europe. So what I'm missing here is Southern. Scandinavia, Eastern, and Russia. That's interesting. Let's see. Nope. Uh, am I still training wrestling? No, I'm not. I'm not. <laughs> but thanks for asking. Uh, commercial. Nope. Okay, terrestrial commercial. I guess we'll have to settle for Sport TV if they'll have us. Okay, they will. Okay, 25%. Okay. And next up, Oceania. How many places in Oceania? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven places. And this is seven. Cool. Okay, that's medium, medium, medium. Okay, they're, air they're airing NXT and Raw, so maybe I'll go somewhere else. Ten bold, maybe? Yeah, and now India. Nope. Cool. Any channels in India that want to just fight TV? Guess I don't have a TV show in India. Well, we're not airing in India, apparently. But there are channels there. Okay, so th these guys only air Indian shows. Is this my own new company? Yep. This is my own new company. Okay, so this is Impact Plus, New Japan World. Okay. How many regions? Three regions in India. Why am I not eligible for this one? So, in India, TV companies only air Indian companies? Is that... Is that so? Feels like a bit of an oversight. I'm pretty sure Indian broadcasters don't just broadcast Indian television. Right? Surely. Okay, we have Union Live in three days. We have no announcers and no titles. So let's get to work on our titles. We're going to call this the Union World Title. Uh, let's go for Jen. Can't go wrong with the big gold. Ah, oh, God, I, I need to change the menus. I forgot to do that. Mm, dumbass. Okay, so that's. Don't like that. Ah, I have more generics here. Cool. Specialists champion. Are you spending the indie yet beyond your generic networks? Yeah. Oh, that's a beautiful intercontinental title. Not as beautiful. Hold on a minute. Hmm. Interesting. 
I like that one. A bit too basic for me, this one. Okay, so five so far. Ooh, I like five and six. I like five and six. I'm, I don't know which one to choose, though. Five or six. Five or six. Five. Oh, five, five is like more classic, but this one. There's something about it that I quite like. Maybe it's the fact that it's a, a title belt with a red strap that isn't ugly. Five is WCW, so five. You like the added color of six. Cool. Chat is as torn as me. Five is WCW. This, this was the WCW title at some point? Really? WCW had beautiful titles. Well, except for a few. There were a few that were god awful but for the vast majority they were nice looking I feel like I always go for six though so I'm gonna go for five that's our that's a world title titles oh cuz that's that's the Royal Rumble that'll that'll that's that okay never mind uh, level primary title that's right I'm digging this playlist, by the way. I'm really digging this playlist. Okay, Union World title. Cool. That's the other world title. It's not WCW as it has on WCW. But it's the same design. Well, same design, though. Okay, let's let's figure out what, what titles that the, there are in the generics. So I can figure out what the mid-card title can be. Let's let's look at these down, down here. Nope. None of that. Oh, no. No. Heavens, no. <laughs> the specialist title. The union specialist title. How about that? The union European... <laughs> well, then. The cruiser... Oh, that's a lovely title. I quite like this one. What's this? Oh, that's the one that's in the generic one. So. Oh, this is this is gonna be my tag team titles, by the way. I'm just gonna do the tag team ones. Uh, uh, level. These are floating. Tag team. Yep. Okay. So how about we have the Bret Hart title? That's that's the Midgard title. Ooh, the Thundercats title. The Marty Skrull title. That's actually, it's actually not bad looking. It's actually not a bad title. The EU title. <laughs> the European title. <clears throat> I don't like the design though. I don't like it. Is there a gen like a just Gen one? There's not. I want something that I that I like the design of it. I actually like the design of it. Maybe Intercontinental. I'm I'm I I really like this one. What's Gen Dual Nations? Uh, good question. Uh, uh it's Scotland and the UK apparently. That generic I see was lovely. The one down there, yeah, it was lovely. Scotland and UK. Uh, I didn't know this title was a thing in the generics. <laughs> it's a hot mess. It really is. Not the best looking one. I'm gonna be honest with you. It's not the best looking title I've ever seen. Am I recording? Yes, I am. Bit late to panic now. I don't like that. Uh, so, I'm I'm thinking this. Okay. I love these generic belts. You need to find more generic. I love them. 
I love the generic belts. They're amazing for these companies. That is a nice title. It is. It's. It feels inspired on the IWGP one, right? Am I wrong? Belt are there belt sites? There are belt sites. Well, hold on. There are belt sites that I don't know about that I could have been using all these years. There's a secondary title, singles. Okay, cool. Prestige, prestige, okay, okay. And now, the women's title. That's about... Oh, li like, literally... Oh, those kinds of belt sites, okay. I thought you had, like, some sort of secret belt site stash where people would make, like, custom belt designs specifically for this. I was very confused. Oh, UFC, what am I doing? Um, hello, cat. Women's. It's women's. Okay, so, generic. Don't like it? Ooh, don't like it. Is there a generic ones? Oh no. <laughs> it's... Better, kinda. Uh, this is the women's title. Uh-huh. Uh, this... What are you doing, cat? Please. Okay, so this is the thing that I... This is the thing that I struggle with, right? Um, I'm not familiar with the stats in this mod, popularity-wise and all that. So I don't know if the women's title should be a primary to be on par with the world, or, or if it should be floating so that I can get it up to that level and then change it to primary. You know what I mean? Because you, you can change the level still, I believe. Like you used to be able to in, the, in 2016. My most popular women. I mean, I would have to say my most popular women would be like the ones from from uh, f like regularly showcased on NXT, like Tainara Conti. She's probably popular. Uh, Diana Perrazzo, she's probably the more popular one. But hold on, I'll show you. Uh, where's my roster? Okay. So let's get... Like... Okay. Let's let's uh, sort by perception. Obviously, nobody's going to be a major star or a star, I believe. So, well-knowns are best. There's no women in well-known so we're gonna go down to recognizable okay crazy Ma forgot about her uh crazy mary dobson so maybe yeah maybe floating maybe floating is the best one if i can get it up to that level of prestige that should be it okay union women's Use this picture, singles, uh, female, floating. There we go. Okay. One thing that I do want to check out. Uh, any perception. Uh, wrestler. Gender. Female. Okay. I have six women. That's a baby face, baby face, heal, 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 heal. I have one more heal. Shit. They all kind of give me good that. Uh, okay. Um, hmm. Oh, so that's how you change that. Okay. I'm thinking I need 
Okay, so I'm gonna have a six way in the first show. Or maybe two triple threats and then a match. But either way, um, how do I schedule my end of the month event? Add new event. Like this. Got it. And this is going to be the one called... Um, nope. Okay, so... This is... Where's Redemption? Where did Redemption go? I feel like there was a Redemption one and it's gone. Bash at the brewery. I seen the TV folder. Ah, oh, dang it. Bash at the brewery. Alright, we're not gonna use the logo, but we're gonna use the name. Union Bash at the brewery. Annual on the, the Sunday week 4 of June. Uh, I'm, I'm not gonna mess with the availability. Yeah, Sunday week 4. Okay, bash at the brewery. Cool. I'd really like to try doing a tournament though. Maybe I'll do that. How do I do that? How do I do a tournament? Anybody know? Okay, so I'm, I'm assuming it's creative tournaments. Okay. Uh, new elimination format. Yeah, Ella. Uh huh. Uh huh. Okay. Four person team. Ah, it only allows like, like, uh, like straightforward tournament. No buys. No nothing. No, no like six person tournament where it, the final is a triple threat. Hmm. Maybe that's what I'll do. I'll do three singles matches. And the final is a triple threat. That's what I'll do. Okay. Okay. Yeah, that's what I'll do. I can have buys. But imagine, like, I want to have a tournament with the, with the, uh, the six women. Well, don't imagine, because that's what I want to have. A tournament with the six women. How do... Yeah, I want I wanted like a, a three-person final, like, like a triple threat. I don't know, I'll I'll figure something out. Okay, so we need to sign announce. We don't have announcers. I just I just realized that we don't have announcers. Six women, two get buys. Wait, but that would. If they get buys, they just move on to the next round. I don't know how you're doing the maths on that one. <laughs> the, but the next round is a final. An eight person tournament. So, do, all right, let's give it a shot. So, eight-person tournament is what you're saying. Okay, so. Let's say I want Killer Kelly. She's a heel. Let's get another heel. Not what I meant. How do I remove? Bye. To position two, no, position one, side B. Got it. Position two, side A. Okay, 
10 out of Conti. She's a heal. Position 2, side A. Okay. Position 3, side A. MJ Jenkins. Position 4, side A. Rachel Elring. That's my 4 heal women. And I have the 3 face women. Who are... Um, Diana Perrazzo. Crazy Mary Dobson. And somebody else. Nope, that's it. Diana Perrazzo and Crazy Mary Dobson. So what I'm going to do... Is... Elring... Diana Perrazzo. That's one. And MJ Jenkins. Can take on... There you go. That's a buy. I think that's it, yeah? Oh, you know what? You're actually... Wait. You're actually right. Never mind. You're... Um, position 3, side A. Oh, um, shit. Okay. Okay. Then out of Conti. Okay, and now to position 2, side A goes MJ and Crazy Mary Dobson. There you go. That fixes it, yeah? Yeah, that makes it cool. Quarterfinals. How do I manage it? Oh, I can replace and remove people. Cool. Oh, I like this feature. I really like this feature. Okay, um, are my ticket prices good? Probably, I'm not gonna worry about that. Uh, can I set like announcers just to be there just so I don't... Okay, you know, sometimes you just gotta take what you can get. Um... do it in English as a as an announcer but I want to push him as a wrestler but I want to push him as a wrestler you know so it's I just need something to hold on he could do both screw it they're doing both The thing is, I'm not even like trying to get him to do commentary. It's just that I need him to do while Mike Tanay uh, and uh, whoever I signed to be with Mike Tanay uh, gets you. Who did I sign? Who was it? Any of you remember? I sure don't. Okay. Okay, let's advance. Finally, we got out of day one, and it only took us one hour.
Tom could attack him while he's Oh, he could. WWE have performed a full draft on their brands in order to freshen up their rosters. Okay. They've loaned out Brock Lesnar as well. <laughs> Lesnar in NXT. Cool. PWG have house show cancelled. What do you mean? House show cancelled why? What does that mean then? What does this mean? Should we perform surgery on uh, on Rusev? I feel like we should. Should we? Yeah, we should. Also, he has a torn bicep. I didn't know he had a torn bicep. Hey, reduce it by two months. Cool. Nice. Um, teams. What does the what does the uh, the house show thing mean? I have 27 active wrestlers on the roster, though. Off duty? Because you're not under exclusive contracts. You for real? Okay. Because I need to change some people to, to exclusive deals. Set. I don't have any major stars. Well, I have me, but okay. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Okay, so that's. Let's seek out the most popular ones. Are there? They're just about the same. Oh, Eric Rohn's a bit more popular. Can I? Exclusive written. Whoa, whoa, hey, hey, hold on. Why would I give him a raise? I didn't offer you that much money. I never went through with it. Oops. Rude. Okay, exclusive. Cool. Uh, oh, 60. Rusev, of course. Well, he's injured, but I want to keep Rusev. He currently makes like 23,000. Why, why, why would I give him a raise, though? Why would I Why would I give him less money than what he's making as well? Okay, that's, that's more reasonable. Four eight eight really, you're negotiating over eighty dollars really. Okay, so that's we're still on one because Rusev doesn't count because he's injured. Okay, okay, that's a forty-five. Hold on, let me scroll down to Canada and that so that I can. Oh, doesn't matter. What was that? Forty-five? Nope. Sixty-five for Eric Young for Canada, right? 
to save it with the dial. Exclusive written. There we go. I didn't offer him an exclusive deal like an idiot. Chris Hero, obviously. So that's Hero. One, two, three, four. Five. Six. That's seven. That's eight. That's nine. That's ten. Eleven. And that's 12. Okay. Once they accept this, we should get our house shows on the run. Or running. I didn't have enough exclusive people. You believe that? Oh, Bobby Roode's retiring. Oh, he is 43. That's fair. Didn't mean to do that. Today's Thursday now? Yeah, show day. I know, house show cancelled, I know. People aren't replying to my offers. Contracts start expiring soon because I set them up to be random. Are the KTV getting the business backgrounds in the pictures? Uh, yeah, the, what, the backgrounds for the pictures and, and, and that? Stuff like that? Should be in the templates in the, in the GDS post. Yeah, this should be in the in the in the in the templates one, because I I believe he has like a templates one, uh, a paragraph. I mean, I didn't finish adding teams. I just half-assed it. Y'all are active. Uh, what do I call these guys? Because Zack Ryder is using Cardona now, Matt Cardona. So. The figure podcast boy. Okay. The figure podcast boys. Got it. The revolt at team. And another team. The colons. They are a unit. What's the difference between unit and permanent unit?
patch the brew in 24 days. So basically, never be split up. Ah, I don't know about that. I don't know about all that. Do I have any promises? I don't do it. Cool. Alright, let's get into booking. People like the Usos, the Harrison. Okay, makes sense. Okay, a generic venue in the Great Lakes has been selected. But what if I don't want a generic venue in the Great Lakes, though? Okay, my popularity is 65 everywhere. 90% potential fan base. 90, 90 enormous. I'm expecting 4,000 people. That's a lot of people. Anywhere else where it's an oh, it's enormous here as well. Tri-state. That's a good beginning. Pick the best option. The RWJ Barnabas Healthcare Arena. That is a good venue. Import the locations from the default data. Ooh, I don't know how to do that. I'll have to do that. Good suggestion. I'll have to do that. Okay, I can start show. Oh, I, I wonder why. Okay, absent workers. Anybody absent? Ethan Carter and Rusev. Cool. What do I have to have? Okay, less, less than three matches with different aims. So, I have to have three differently aimed matches. We're going to open the show with Kurt Angle. I have a... Fuck off. Where's the incident? Oh. David Finley. What have you done? Cool. Poker. Everybody like, likes poker. Poker's fun. Thanks, Finley. Uh... How's the... What a... It's metal. Rider. Okay, so let's do Matt Cardona and Brian Myers. Extremely unlikely to achieve anything in this situation. Let's give it a shot. It achieved nothing. But now we know. I probably should have pre-booked the tournament matches, so let's let's do that. Okay, Ellering versus Perazzo. I gotta remember that. But first, the Kurt Angle angle. They should be friends already in this mod, to be honest. They should be. Okay, um... Nope, they're not meeting up. Okay, so let's let's do... A nice, well, Kurt Angle promo to open the show. I don't have any storylines yet, but I will in a bit. Once I actually get the show on the road and I have like announcers and everything and, and champions and that and I get a better idea of who's where on the roster okay angle promo is running for five minutes here yeah. let's script him though easily fixed okay angle promo to open the show Ellering versus Perazzo Perazzo vs. Rachel Ellering, shorter match. Okay. And the other one was MJ vs. who? Crazy Mary Dobson. Excluded already booked. Okay. What are you recognizable? Uh. 
Uh, MJ. Let's try. Bit of a longer match this one because Crazy Mary Dobson is a bit more popular, so I'm gonna give him a little bit more time. Okay, now for the title scenes. I believe I have four tag teams, right? I, I, yeah, I have four tag teams, and none of them are injured. Cool. Okay, heal, face, heal, heal. Shit. Okay. Let's have ourselves an unofficial tournament. Luke Gallows and Parland. Could just do teams. I'm an idiot. Versus the Revolt. Um. Let's do some storytelling in this one, yeah. These two and these two, the Colognes versus the Figure Podcast Boys. A shorter match. Can y'all steal the show? Not picking winners. At least one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight well known names. Four faces, four heels. Cool. Uh but I only have I only have seven more minutes. There you go. Now I have 12. Oh shit. Um, starting to think maybe an hour isn't enough time for the TV show. I need an angle. How about I do this for next week? Search. Okay. Ah, shit. I don't know. Okay. Well, I don't remember who's a face and who's a heel. Wait. Never mind. Okay, so Rockstar Spud, Mike Bennett, anybody that wasn't in a match today. Keith Miller, Chris Hero. Those are the faces. Which means the other ones are the heels. Which means Aiden English. Eric Young. Eric Rowan. And Leo Rush. Got it. Um, I four four v four oops, four v four. And these are the guys that are going to be involved in the world title scene. These eight guys thinking a tournament. I love tournaments. Yeah, yeah, think in the tournament. Check my DMs, check my DMs where? Oh. 
Oh, thanks, Miles. Oh, that is that is beautiful. Thank you. Miles is the best. Miles is good friend. Everybody subscribe to Miles on Twitch and YouTube. Thank you, thank you, Miles. You are the best. This only runs for one minute? Fine. I don't even need this. I can make the match happen tonight. In like 15 minutes. That's easy. Oh no, you just don't need to fancy it up. It's beautiful. It's perfect like this. Okay, so, well, no, star, yeah, well known. Faces. Wait, I'm missing something here. Because clearly there's a. Joe Hennig. That's the one I was missing. Okay. That's fine. Yeah, I'll just, I'll just pull it in English. Okay. Uh. Yeah, four v four, I guess. Uh huh. Union is pushing only X W W E stars. How dare you! That is the entire roster. How dare you? I'm not gonna push any jabronis from the indies, bingo halls, and all that shit. Nah. Former WWE people only. Shit. Booking analysis screen has potential issues. What? Less than three matches had different aims? Okay. Um. Um, for the for the tournament ones, no. For this one, yeah. For this one, I pick Chris Hero to win. Okay, let's do Wild Brawl, I guess. Okay. Who are we not using? We're not. Ooh, we're not using a lot of people. Where's Lance Storm and, and all those people there? He's a road agent. Okay. Oh, that's right. I'm gonna put Lance Storm on the job on this one. Does that take him out of the list? It does. Okay. Okay. I see you. 97, okay. I need to shorten these matches. I, I need to make the show longer an hour and a half okay 65 minutes worth of show good luck me
Okay. After a strong start, Backstage Promo we will welcome into the very first Union Live show. Next segment. Terrible wrestling, no crowd heat, shit. No announcers. What do you mean no announcers? All right. That's fair. That's fair. That's okay. That's okay. Great chemistry for the colons. Return to booking screen. What? What about what? What? I have announcers. They're not very good ones, but I have them. <laughs> oh, great chemistry. Cool. Need to build up MJ Jenkins's popularity, and that can be a few in the river in the in the in the near future. Okay, Serena Deeb's work as a road agent was less than stellar, but that's fine. Next segment, the ball club defeats the revolt, excellent chemistry from the revolt, cool, yeah huh, we'll be seeing these guys, and we see these guys, okay, no announcers, okay, the crowd wasn't buzzing on red, Chris Hero pinned Joe Hennig with a hangman's elbow, oh, I didn't want him to pin Joe, I wanted him to pin Leo, I forgot about that, dang it, alright, Finish the show. We increased our pop in 32 regions. So that's kind of a win. Kind of a win. You know. Bit of a win. Bit of a loss. Small loss. But a great win. Gotta look at the bright side. You know. Look at the positives. We got a show done. That's a positive. And we just signed three new people. How useful is that button, by the way? The just the, the the sign all people button. How useful is that? It's a very good button to have. Nah, -uh, no way. You're not signing Crazy Mary Dobson to yourself. What are you offering? A handshake. Exclusive written. How about that? Uh uh. Y'all ain't taking the best woman I got. No We're not doing that. No Who did I sign, by the way? <laughs> not what I meant to do. Who did I sign? Oh, it was Velasquez, Mike Tanay, and Stu Bennett. Cool. So, announcers. Um, Y'all aren't very good, so I'm replacing you with the fourth mic in the company. Stu Bennett, here we go. Okay, cool. And we have Kane Velasquez now, which is cool as well. What popularity? Is yet to get a perception rating. Okay. Cool. Uh we could be onto something with Kane Velasquez. Um I'm gonna let him stay away from the world title scene for the foreseeable future because he's an MMA guy I just I don't want to push him immediately but I could say mystical uh, does it because I'm pretty sure he has yet to get a perception Kane where's Kane Kane he's yet to get a perception rating so he shouldn't show up in any of these yeah he is yet to get a perception rating. My finances, though, that's what I want to check. Am I losing money? Do you have the, the latest patch, though? People are getting one, probably a bit of bug they have fixed, yeah. Because I'm using the latest patch, and probably that was not supposed to happen. 
Ok I'm losing money $41,000 I'm losing I nearly I, j I nearly closed the game I accidentally I nearly accidentally Oh, Taguchi Japan has a new leader. Remember to set your logo. I will, I will, I will, I will. And I'll do it off stream after the thing about bopper, but, but I will. I'll remember that. Uh, oh, I'm, I'm gonna retweet this awesome tweet by this school madly in this Retweet that. This will be on, um, on YouTube, by the way. I am recording this for, for YouTube as well. Uh, so if you're watching this on YouTube so far. Hi, hello. Taguchi Japan. Cody takes leadership. Uh, what? Hello? Kenny Omega is going to be taking a leadership role within the elite. Cody's going to take a leadership role within the elite. Excuse me. Excuse me. Yeah, Los Psycho Circus is ended. You know, it was time. It was time. Complete all this. Lost strippers. They've altered the terms of their contract offer. Mine is the only one she's seriously considering, so I'm all good. I actually quite like the. Is this this is the normal skin skin for the game, yeah, no? And it's UK hired Chuck Mambo. <laughs> It's real nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is normal. It's quite nice. It's so much better than than what it was. Like, that was that was awful when it was. That was that was crap. Oh, more signings complete. Thank you. And we're on to week two. Look at that. Look at how fast we're moving. Fast I'm moving through this game. I'm beating this game. There's a new team. What an original name. They're called the Partners. Oh, uh, it's a uh, show, TV show. Uh, TV show. I mean, make the TV show longer. Have to do. Oh, he's got a brand new move in his arsenal. Look at that. Wowing the fans. Okay, so why am I not doing house shows now? I should have 12. I have to toggle them. I don't remember who it is. It's not this guy. This guy, she's she hasn't signed. Ah, damn, who was it? It 
It didn't do it. I have to do it manually. Oh my god. Are you kidding me? I have to do it manually? Okay. Epico. Nope. Eric Young was he one? He was one. He is not one. Is he one? Yeah. Not Killer Kelly. Carl Anderson. Not Carl Anderson. Okay, well. Nope. I have to do this manually. Why am I trying to get Mike Taney on house show? What the hell is wrong with me? Okay, Rusev's now on the house show duty. Even though he's injured. Don't know how that was. Wow, that's gonna close. Don't know how that's gonna work, but. Okay, so that's one, two, three. Do I have 12 now? Am I missing somebody here? What? Okay, exclusive written, so Brian Myers. Cash Wheeler. Dax Harwood. The hell, I thought I had enough. Okay, WWE step away from progress. Okay, good for progress, I guess. Progress in WWE split. Okay. Okay, and that will allow me to get Crazy Mary Dobson on the circuit. Okay, now I have enough workers on the on the roster for the thing of poppers. Cool, I can now run house shows. Oh look at Drew Galloway. Currently the WWE champion. He's a light heavyweight. No he's he is not. <laughs> Fuck out. Is he? Is he a light heavyweight? Pretty sure he's a bit. Pretty sure he's a bit big for a light heavyweight. House show held. Yeah, that's what I was saying. Nowadays, he's, there's no way he's a light heavyweight. Back, back when he was a young boy, maybe. He's a, he's a big boy. He's a big, good, strong boy. Two thousand buckaroos. Look at that. Making money. All right, our next TV show is tonight. Oops. Let's, let's give ourselves half an hour. Let's give ourselves half an hour. We're gonna have two of the uh, what? Yep, do that in a bit. Backstage incident. Mike Kyoda. Mike Kyoda brightened the mood backstage after doing several funny cartoon drawings of his colleagues. Look at that. He's a funny guy. Uh, pick the best option. He's five pounds over the light heavyweight bottom limit in TW now. Really? Doesn't look like it. Looks like a big bulky boy. Okay. Um. What? Uh. What am I doing? Two ninety to three twenty. That's that's heavyweight. He's, he's not t 290. 
Okay, we're gonna have Killer Kelly versus Crazy Mary Dobson. Uh, she's recognizable, so I, I guess. This can go on the main show. Crazy Mary Dobson will go over. And, uh... I don't remember who the other one was. I have to get your tea. Alright, enjoy your tea. Ellering. Okay, it's Ellering versus Tainada. This is going on the pre-show. Storytelling match. Hey, it's been one my fault. Thanks for the follow. How's it going, my dude? Here we are, show stiller, I guess. We're gonna, we're gonna have Hero go over. And the other fatal four way. Dan Severn is another card, this card is not worth a watch. I mean, he is technically a WWE release, but I don't think that counts. Also, hi Caramel, how's it going? <laughs> uh, let's have Mike Bennett, Rockstar Spud, Joe Hennig. And Eric Young. How's 2020? It's uh, it's much better than my past experiences with it. I will say that. Uh, it's it's vastly improved. The the UI is much better. Buying it Friday. Yeah, I mean it's definitely you know the the beta version of it was was it was bad. It was bad. The play testers really dropped the ball. Um. It was not ready to be out. It was not even close to being an acceptable game. Like. But now, much better. Yeah, yeah, I didn't buy it on release specifically for that. I wanted to see how how the game would pan out after release. And once I saw like the, the, uh, the adjustments they made to the UI, how the game works now, the... I would actually, I can actually look at the game and not have my eyes hurting. It's much better. Yeah, it's, it's definitely... Now it feels like a TW game. Now it feels like one. It didn't feel like one earlier. Yeah, way too many buttons. It was a mess. It looked like a mess. Hey Mike, how's it going? Yeah, the beta was terrible, but glad they took time to do necessary changes. Yeah, definitely. They needed to do these changes. The game would would not have would not have sold well, I don't think, in in its first condition. What mod am I playing? I'm playing the Killing the Business mod, the latest version of the Killing the Business mod. We're doing Union. Basically, we're taking every WWE release from earlier this year, making company with all of them. I'm good, I'm good. 
thank you for asking, uh, Mike. Uh, we're taking all of them, making a company with them, and taking it to WWE. Everybody they released it for loads. Every everybody they got screwed over by by WWE earlier this year. Okay, so last show we had who go over the Bullet Club and the Figure Podcast Boys. Okay, so now I'm gonna give. Uh, no, Gulak is available now. I have him in the roster. <laughs> Mr. Big Nose, who's Mr. Big Nose? I actually have Gulak on the roster. Right there. Drew Gulak. Look at this lad. He's right here. Added him last night. 3 a.m. So, the Revolt lost and the Colons lost. So I'm going to give him a second chance match. And now the rest is going to be angles. No, this is actually the default uh, look for the game now. It's so much better. I, I actually am using the default skin, which is, some, yeah, it's so much better. It's so much better, can I move? Uh, what am I doing? Drew like yeah. Gonna hype him up. Actually, gonna hype Kane Velasquez up. Yeah, let's have a five minute angle to hype him up. That's not the show opener. Can you transfer sale? I believe so, but I haven't tried. If that makes sense. Does that program work? What I what I saw was that if you use that program and that messes up your software, that they're not gonna give you support for it. So I wouldn't advise you to do it, to be honest. Um yeah, the 87 save you told me about. Yeah. I mean, I'd like to transfer the the, 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 the UFC one, but I don't think I'm going to risk it. Oh my god, the announcers are all wrong. Oh, psh. The announcers have been all wrong this whole time. It's meant to be Mike Tanay and, and Stu Bennett. Another thing I like is in results, you can look back and see the full match breakdowns and the different angles. Yeah, yeah, that that's actually really good when you're looking back. There's something that's like, it's such a small feature, but it's so welcome so needed i didn't even know it was needed until i got it you know what am i doing okay right let me just quickly correct all of these dang it i forgot to change my my announcers because i had like makeshift announcers for the first show I put Mike Bennett instead of Mike Tanay. Okay. Okay, now we got some. Yeah, I noticed that. That's so cool. Yeah, the 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 stable spectrum things. Yeah, yeah. It's very it's very like graphics friendly. This game I have noticed like a lot of the things that didn't have graphics before now they do, and it it it's one of those things that it shouldn't matter much, but it does. It just it pulls you into the game a little bit more. What else is graphics like? 
every mage you can think, think that could have a graphic, it probably has one. There's this graphic thing, it's a, every worker has a picture, you know? It's very, it's very innovative. Nobody ever thought of it. Okay, I need one more aimed match. have what are you what mod this is the killing the business mod jack russell it's a regular wrestler okay regular wrestler yeah killing the business the ktv mod the one thing you were worried about was when it said it was going to be like wmma full render esque size pictures Ooh. That would have been that would have been bad, yeah. I would not have liked that. Let's do these two. They haven't been on the show. Let's make it a technical masterclass. Let's have Gulak go over. Book segment. Okay. And let's have... So for 2020 again. <laughs> Park Champ. It's 2020 Park Champ now. Uh, if I were to assign a Twitch emote to TW 2020, would it be Park Champ though? Yeah. Yeah. I guess now, yeah, it's a Park Champ. Let's see how good Levis Valenzuela is on promos. He's gonna cut a promo on Drew Gulak. It's for you, David Miles. I will stream 2020 and start it. Ooh. Ooh. He's only ever played WMMA demos, never bought. Me neither. Yeah, me neither. I've never bought the game. I, I got the, the demo for an April Fool's video years ago. And that's pretty much my experience with WMMA. Uh, singles match. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's good. That just gets a promo on him. Not what I meant to do. Oh, you can stream your truck. Nice. Okay, Levis is used far too much on this show. Let's cut down on the Levis. Should be fixed. Slightly overused. Okay. Should be fixed. It is fixed. Cool. I need 15 more minutes. Okay, let's have let's have these two duke it out. Is Shana on a written deal with AEW? I don't know. Haven't checked. Who's my top guys? Ooh, that's. Hard to tell right now, weirdly enough, the most popular guy I have, uh, guys I have are Eric Rowan and Eric Young. So that's the thing. I 
and let's have Zach versus uh, Carl or Matt, I guess. My, yeah, my company is, that's the story behind the company. Uh, Union is everybody that the WWE released in 2020, basically making a, a company just with them and anybody WWE releases from then on to, uh, to basically make a union, I guess. It's sort of like a, a reference to the necessity for a union of wrestlers. Um, which is why the company is called Union. Not a, not a very creative name, but effective. Okay, and we're gonna... Where am I going? Do I have a set venue? Gen <coughs> generic venue in the Great Lakes. Okay, enormous. Let's... Huntington Beach. Hey, I started this show. What now? Runtime error three two six five. I just want to report to. Uh, I just want to report to Adam. There goes the game. Let's try that again. I went to the wrong screen as well. I, I meant to go to the B right back one. So how's everything, chat? How's it going? Oh my god, no, tell me. Tell me it didn't do that. Did I just lose everything that I just booked for that show? Uh, we got, we got a runtime error. The previous Monday of game time. Ah, shit. You kidding me? Well then. Ah. <sighs> I have to book everything all over again? Are you kidding me? Fuck it all. All right, well. I remember it was Killer Kelly versus Crazy Mary Dobson. That was one. The other women's match was Tainara versus Rachel. And that was a pre-show one. They don't have... Oh my god, all of that. Mm, thank you, Mike. Are you kidding me? I have to do that all over again. Mike, Tanay, and Stu Bennett. Jesus. I have to do that all over again, dude. This is lazy. Beat some. It needs 15 minutes, and that's too much for levies, I think. Unless I don't have a segment. Okay, book segment, booking analysis. I'm using him too much already. 
What if it's Aiden? Uh I'm just gonna have all the teams now. Can't be bothered. The Colons the figure podcast boys and Dex Hallwood and Cash Wheeler. As that that's a match. There we go. Book segment. Why are you? A Why would you be a road agent, Brian? Why would you be a road agent? That's freaking uh, storytelling. One more, steal the show. How's save going? Well, we just booked an entire show and the game crashed. So that happened. And that reminds me, it's just save. Save, save the game, just save the game quickly, you know? Let's see. Try to intimidate publicly fires. No. Sorry that yeah, it sucks because well now I'm doing the show different, so I guess that's a cool thing. Okay, angle signs Velasquez. I didn't even, I didn't even, I didn't even extend the show to an hour and a half. That's, oh my god, it put me back to before I extended it to an hour and a half. Are you kidding me? Hayden B69, thanks for the follow. Nice, nice name. Nice name, Hayden. Do I have multiple? Yeah, I have, I have two. I have uh, Scott Armstrong and my Kyoda. Um, I guess you're going to have to steal the show wait is this not what what's the booking slightly overused I can deal with that I can I can do that okay yeah no different aims but they do have different aims this one? Nope, it do they don't. Never mind. There you go. Now we can start the show. Okay, cool. For the next show, I'm going to have to remember to extend the show. Look at, look at this. What, what, what kind of show is this? Also, this is way too long. Okay, I have 10 minutes, so I can still do something. So maybe let's do... well-known faces let's do hero and Miller versus Leo and Eric well it's a fatal four-way but local global no this is a uh, custom save where I took every WWE um, release from earlier this year if you remember a WWE release like uh, a lot of people uh, so I had an idea to 
get them all in one company together. Um, sort of get revenge at the WWE, you know? Uh, 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 okay, I have 10 minutes, so. Well, I can shorten the other one, though. Okay, that is the main event. I said, hey, thanks, Hayden. Um, I need to cut, like, what? Three minutes? I need to cut four more minutes. Cool, that's fine. One, two, three, four. Hell, I even cut another one. Uh, let's shorten this one. Okay, how much time do I have? I'm gonna, I'm gonna add one more minute to this. Save the show. It saved. If it crashes, hopefully it doesn't. But if it crashes, it should put us back here. It didn't crash. Okay, so. In an abysmal pre-show match, Rachel Elring defeated Tanara Conti in 656 by pinfall. Okay. Next segment. We open the show. Kurt Angle announces the major signing, Kane Velasquez. Former WWE star, AAA star, UFC fighter, Kane Velasquez. Good. Uh... Crazy Mary Dobson defeats Killer Kelly and moves on in the tournament. So it, it'll be K uh, Crazy Mary Dobson versus Rachel Ellering. Drew Gulak beat Aiden English with a spine splitter. Cool. We had a fit. Ooh, nice match. 57 rating. That's good. Uh, the Colon the Colons won. Well then. That's interesting. You're the weakest in the ring. And about that, uh, Eric R Eric Rowan won. Huh. Look at that. Okay, 59 rating. That's not bad. A 59 is not a bad rating. I don't know if that's the minimum for our broadcasters, but it's not bad. You know. It's not too bad. OVE disbanded. Okay. So Calva... Wow. So Calvell signs with WWE, going to NXT UK. Makes sense. She is living there. Okay. Uh, I don't need to see this here. I need to see this here so I can compare. Okay, we got like 12. Uh, like our rating was better by like 12 points. Got more attendance. We got no warning, so we did better. Cool. Okay, so maybe we just need to stick to one hour. Or maybe I just need to not have lower rated segments. Alright. What's this? Complete all worker signings. Cool. Posting on social media, John Cena stated the controversial view that he thinks that out of shape wrestlers are an embarrassment to the profession. This does not sound like John Cena. Provoked a withering reply from Bray Wyatt who pointed out that despite the fact that he was unlikely to get any gigs as a model, he could still put on a badass match at the drop of a hat. Well, he can still put on a badass match at the drop of a hat. But this doesn't sound like John Zena though. I don't know, it feels like this this one thing isn't very well designed. John Cena putting this out. It's probably something to do with his personality. But it doesn't sound like he'd say that. Well if he did he didn't he wouldn't publicly say it. You know what I mean? What am I doing? I need to check my finances. 
Ow, just got stabbed by my cat. We're making money? No, we're losing money. We're losing $55,000 this month. Okay. How, how much? Who's the most expensive? Finley. Finley and Rotunda. Okay, so if I fire... <laughs> if I fire Finley and Rotunda... You've seen it multiple times from him and saves. So like in, in other mods as well? Not just this one? If I get rid of Finley and Rotunda, I'll, I'll be good. I'll be in the money. Now that I realize it. They're very expensive. Oh, that's interesting. Maybe it just picks a popular person from the company and it picks someone with a with a, a like a larger body type to reply to them, I guess. Maybe that's how that event works. Those two are costing me a lot of money for road agents. You've seen KO? Okay, so that's probably how it works. Okay, that makes more sense. It doesn't really strike me as like their their, their personality types don't really strike me as that. So it there had there what? Okay, there had to be an explanation. Okay, complete all worker signings. Uh, let's go into our house shows now and f where are they house shows and put the uh, the guys that we just signed on duty on duty are you nope nope never mind I think that was it I think it was Carl Anderson Complete all signing. I love that button so much, dude. <laughs> I actually love it. Okay. Need to find a way to make more money because this is not working out for us. But we'll, we'll get to the pay-per-view though. Once we get to that pay-per-view, I'm sure we'll, we'll make good money. Oh, the great mood at the reset. Oh, there we did. Catchphrase for Brock Lesnar. Look at that. He debuted a new catchphrase at Backlash. What? Brock Lesnar and Elias? Brock Lesnar and Elias. Ethan Carter is now back with the company. Delete all. What are you? Well known. Okay. EC3 is back in the in, in the uh, in the company.
Oh, Bully Rain Velvet Sky Cage. Look at that. Fans amazed by Darby Allen debuting a brand new move. Okay. Hold on. My cat keeps trying to jump on my head, which isn't very pleasant. can be a one hour show. Okay, so I'm just gonna do one hour shows. It works. It seems to work. We don't need that extra hour. You know? Oh, Eric Rowan's a star now, is he? Okay. Okay. Okay, so faces. Aiden English. Rockstar Spud. And now the heels. Joe Hennig. And who was it again? I believe that was it. Am I only hiring WD? Yes, I'm only hiring WWE uh, rejects from the point where there was a mass release this year forward. Or for some rare exceptions, like if I need an announcer or something, I'll settle for somebody who at one point or another. Where is Alex Riley? You're not, you're actually not the first person to ask that in this stream. You're actually not, surprisingly enough. Road Agent Notes, NXT Alex Riley. The, uh, despite all my rage, I'm still just Alex Riley in a cage. That one. I never actually saw like Riley versus Steen or Riley versus Owens, I guess. Okay, the final is at the actual show. Winner of that faces Thingamabopper. We're gonna add ourselves an angle and get our first storyline going. Uh, what? No. There you go. <laughs> you redeem your highlighted message just for hashtag hire Riley. <laughs> All right, that's that's dedication to the bit. That is that is some serious dedication to the bit. All right. I'll I'll look I'll look for him after the show. Just let me finish this show. Uh, that reminds me. Add storyline. Spud versus EC3. Rockstar Spud versus Ethan Carter the third. I'm not gonna put a description in yet, but this will start the storyline. Hmm. 
This could be a good match. Let's see what this does. Okay, so that was very dying up the top. So this will be a steal the show match. Up, oh, Johannig is double booked. Never mind. Two hero versus young, that could be a good match. Okay. And let's have Cain Velasquez. Wait, can I buy, can I, local, can I get a local? Where do I get a local? Look at this local. <laughs> Look at this local fella. I mean, you be used as a face. not get CM Punk. Technically was he technically was. I could technically sign him. Alex Ryder versus Eric Young would be bad. <laughs> would it though? But would it though? He was, he was a WWE reject as well. Technically. I just wanted Kane Velasquez to squash somebody really. Um, let's uh... Maybe let's do the tag team titles. I could wait for the special event though. I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait for the special event to do that. Uh, let's do... Punk and Riley for tag champs. <laughs> I don't have enough women for this, what the fuck? have Mary Dobson and Diana Perrazzo versus let's do that could be a good team I don't know Seven more minutes. Okay. Okay. At angle, and let's have. Okay, we're gonna have Kurt Angle, rated on his overness. He's gonna cut a promo. The champ. Yeah, the champs are highlighted gold. That's really cool. gonna get Eric Rowan he's gonna be standing there all menacingly angle do I have to take I think you have to take the box to scroll still I mean here I've ticked the box so I believe I I, I don't have to take it again so I can scroll it okay I ticked that box back in the beta it should still be ticked okay angle Presents world 
championship contender. And basically, basically, what Kurt Angle is gonna say is that um, Eric beat three of the best in the industry last week. So whoever wins the Fatal Four Way later tonight faces Eric Rowan at um, Redemption. Well, it's not called Redemption, I forgot. It's Bash at the Brewery. So at Bash at the Brewery, apparently it's going to be Rockstar Spud versus... Nope. Rockstar Spud versus uh, Eric Rowan. Velasquez squashes Bradley. Nobody cares about this match apparently. Got a 36 rating. Who am I playing as? I am Kurt Angle. I am Kurt Angle, the founder of the union. Chris here defeats Eric Young with a hangman's elbow. Cool. Rockstar Spud pins Leo Rush. Nice. With a five stone Spud splash. Cool. And we get the return of EC3 who uh, we're thinking of different unions there uh, the, that one is the inferior union this is the superior union uh, Ethan Carter beats down Rockstar Spud just, just really lays into him just going savage beating him up 49 we went back down in the, in the uh, overall rating Politics of Peter Avalon. I know, I know, you're all unhappy. I know. Okay? I know. Okay, Spud vs. CC3. That's the storyline. We're also going to add. World. Eric Rowan. Peter Avalon, the librarian, Rockstar Spud in a supporting role, uh, Ethan Carter III in a supporting role. Eric Rowan versus question marks. Okay, and we're also going to add Rachel Elring and uh, Crazy Mary Dobson, that's another one. Dobson versus Elring. I'm not sure. They are both heels, yeah. Okay, so these 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 are two heels. Right, Alex Riley. I was hoping you'd forget that. Okay, so he's not here, which means he must be under Kevin. Why is he this? Why is, why is he on the list? Kevin, Kevin, not on the mod, my dude. He is not here. Not in the mod. I looked for him. It's almost time for <laughs> higher punk. Do you know how expensive he'd be? I'm already losing money to two 62 year olds. Granted, they're useful and.
punk wouldn't be? Robert. Why would he be Robert, Kylie? Is he Robert? No. No. Nope. Oh, Kevin Robert. I didn't know. Maybe Kevin Robert? Nope. Carson Oakley. Who's Carson Oakley? Is it? No way is that his actual last wrestling name. That's... What? No. Did he use that on Glow or something? Sheesh. My god. Oh, new champion in NXT. He lost the title to Tommaso Ciampa. Adam Cole lost the title to Tommaso Ciampa. Now medium company as well. Yeah, he could be a good job. Mike Seidel. Oh, that's, uh, that's Matt's brother, isn't it? Oh, Taya Valkyrie's pregnant. It's almost time for the go-home show. So now that 2020 is out, what mods have been made for 2020? Uh... I think there's like a, a 1980s, like, kind of like the War of Immortals mod. There's a bunch of wrestlers out of their timelines and their prime. Uh, it's called the TARDIS mod. Um, I think there's like real. What? CM Punk and Adam Pierce are at loggerheads. After some heated social media exchanges, it erupted as CM Punk criticized the match that happened to involve a friend of Adam Pierce's and he leapt in to defend it. What? Never seen this. The TARDIS mod. Pretty good, nice. I I like the idea of it. It seemed pretty interesting. What what do you do? What roles do you do? I'm gonna try to convince him to come out of retirement. All right. <laughs> I'm gonna try to convince CM Punk to come out of retirement. Let's do this. But well, he doesn't want to do that. Why not? Why don't you want to do that? It's just rude that, isn't it? Can you part mods across? Yeah, I think so. I believe you can Im like import mods. In, in pictures, yeah, pictures, yeah, 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 yeah. I believe so. GG. I tried, guys. I tried to get CM Punk back, you know? I tried. I did my best. I did what I could. I... Rude. I did what I could, guys. You know, I... I uh... I did what I could, guys. It's on hiatus. Shit. Matt Seidel and PJ Black. Uh, when I'm making money. <laughs> Let me reset. Oh, I'm stupid. There. 
Okay. On to our go-home show. Right, we're going to start off the show. Okay, I have, I have incidents. Hold on. Let me, let me handle this. Eric Young. Okay, cool. Cool. Thanks. Uh, we're going to start the show off. Um... with a medical update medical update on Rockstar Spud we are informed that he has been pulled from Bash at the Brewery so there must be and am I getting SR? SR? what's SR? song request um unlikely <laughs> cause this, play this playlist that you're listening to guys um this is copyright free so this allows me to keep the VOD unmuted I can put the video up on YouTube no issues it's copyright free music or at least it says it is I'll find out You request that song. I'll check it out when when uh, when I get the opportunity. What was I doing? Uh, okay, uh, this. Let's have ourselves a six-way. Three faces, three heels. Chris Hero, Heath Miller, and Mike Bennett. Eric Young, Joe Hennig, and Leo Rush. Winner is Chris Hero. Chris Hero moves on to face Eric Rowan at Hello Mild. You missed a lot. The game crashed on our second show. I had to book it from the ground up. It's going well. It's going well. It's actually going well. Yeah, it wasn't pleasant. Uh... Okay, 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 okay. We need tag teams. Okay, so Bullet Club has one win over the Revolt. The Figure Podcast Boys have... He claims Alex Riley is an animal. He's, he's not. You saw it. You saw he's not. I showed you. Don't be. Don't be defaming me. This is slander. Actually, it's libel. Okay. Um. I don't want the rage. I don't want it. I don't want it. I, I personally deleted Alex Riley from the mod uh, just so the rage would not happen. He also missed me trying to get CM Punk, Sting, and AJ Lee out of retirement. They wouldn't. I mean, AJ Lee is out of the business. She won't even talk to me. The last. Uh, the last. Case. Sting is gone. He's on hiatus. And Punk doesn't want to come out of retirement. So I'm gonna have. Damn it! <laughs> Stop using your highlighted messages for that. 
<laughs> How do I delete someone else's chat message? So we're going to have one representative of each team. So that's Luke, Primo, Brian, and Dax. Oh my god. Dax, how... Yeah, it's it's definitely a name. Uh, I'm not picking a winner for this one. So as you can tell, there's been a bit of a medical update on Rockstar Spud uh, in storyline. Ethan Carter the third returned last show and attacked him. Uh, he had just earned his spot at Bash at the Brewery, he was going to face Eric Rowan for the world title, but Ethan Carter III has taken him out of commission uh, and is not bothering to appear tonight, so he'll explain his actions at Bash at the Brewery. Um, it's Pig Chimp. I, it's, actually, it's actually an amazing name for an emote. <laughs> Honestly, I like it. <laughs> and I'll also have the other members of the tag team. And that'll be Carl. Oh, and I had um, Kane Velasquez squash Jay Bradley, a local wrestler who was also in the WWE. He was also in TNA. Uh, for a little bit, I remember booking him in TNA back in my EWR save. All I'm saying is King Dication. <laughs> yeah, Jay Bradley. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The Fighting Irishman, yes. Also, one of the guys that's actually suing or sending a cease and desist to uh, The Revolt. Because he's in the original The Revolt. It came about as my mate was on his phone and was trying to type Pog Champ but kept saying Pig Champ. <laughs> Love it. And we are going to have ourselves a good old fashioned stare down. Nope. Confrontation. I'll probably only listen after after stream. Uh caramel. Um This hero gets attacked by Eric Rowan. We end the show. Rowan standing tall over Chris Hero. And let's change the storyline. And that'll change that to... Is it Alex Riley's theme? Because if it is, it's genuinely a very good song.
It's actually not. Ooh. All right. All right, let's run this row. Get a medical update on Rockstar Spot. Cool. Cash Wheeler was the best performer in this match. Cool. Gallows was the best performer in this one. Chris Hero, Hangman's Clutch, Face Buster on Miller for the win. Gets attacked by Eric Rowan. We finish the show. Cool. New Roman Reigns feud. Ooh, Reigns versus Rollins. No one's ever seen that. And AJ Styles versus Daniel Bryan. Who wants to see that? Oh, no. Well, I've been dropped from literally every network. Um, so that's, that's something. Okay, well, um, thank God my next show is a pay-per-view then. Um, it's still on FX. Switch to an afternoon slot. That should get me safe there. Okay, so. Let's try to get our, our um, back. Our show. Oh, fuck off. Okay, well, I'll do that after. It'll use my Twitch Prime sub to get that emote. The limb be cancelled. Okay, let's just do the pay-per-view and I'll figure something out after. Shit. That's a major setback, to be honest. That's a major setback on the company. Okay. It's Vince threatening the networks. It's Vince. He's working against us. This is all his doing. Let's do bash at the brewery. No backstage incidents. Cool. Huh? Broadcasters have not been set. Use this one. Why would I use anyone else? Save the selection. This. I only have one. Why would I? What, what, why? Why? Why would I use any other broadcaster? Talking Stick Resort Arena. Cool. Okay, let's do this. First of all, the tag team titles match. It's gonna be still the show match. I'm thinking.
Actually, I only have one face stack team. I might give it to them. Yeah, I'm, th I th I'm thinking I'm gonna give it to them. Because that'll allow for a longer reign. Yeah, that's what I'll do. Ooh, that's a long match, never mind. Hold on. Cut that back a bit. Okay. Okay. Let's get a let's get a high prestige match. Let's, let's do that. Ooh. Ladder match. Did I make that tag, that four way tag team for the titles? Because I was supposed to do that, and I don't think I did. I definitely didn't, because I didn't go anywhere near this part of the screen. Eric Rohn's a star, so I might as well bank on him while he's popular. Then again, I could get Chris Hero over. He'll get his turn. You, Chris here will get his turn. I'll just, it'll probably give it to Eric Rowan. What's their momentum like? I clicked the wrong part of the screen. Uh, warm momentum and the other one has... As soon as I find them, warm. They're both warm momentum. The thing is, like, Eric Rowan's a star. Quite a bit more popular than actually. Oh yeah, in these areas, yeah. In uh, in the UK and uh, in Europe, Eric's more popular. Yeah, Ron's definitely my choice. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go. He's also younger, so there's there's that. For the world. Oh, what? Tag team. What? Okay, for the women's. Lizzie Mary Dobson versus Rachel Ellering. That is for the women's title. Now I need their battle royale one. Ah, that's six. Uh, that's too many. Uh, let's do a fiddle four way elimination match. Okay, so not well known. You rush. Yeah. And we're gonna give this to my boy Drew Gulak. Okay. I need 19 more minutes. Cool. Let's see, what, 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 what else can I, not a lot, I can book a whole lot more. Okay, 
Alright, let's have Kane. Strong though. I want to build Kane up, but I want to do it at the expense of my younger talent. Or well, my not as old talent. Visual Elring is being used too much. Cool. Let me fix that. There we go. Okay. Uh. I should have a returning from injury angle. Nope. Rockstar Spud gets some payback on Ethan, who believes he took out Rockstar Spud. See, Ethan is cutting a promo on, on Rockstar Spud. Three more minutes. Know what I meant to do. Okay, maybe maybe I have angle open the show. Okay. It's time. Let's run our first pay-per-view and hopefully it won't tank. Okay, we got off to a strong start. Ah, uh, shit. Um, hold on. Hold on. Selling is uh, that he won. How do I? Okay, how do I make an angle change it like this? Never mind. Intercontinental Drew Gulak is given the Intercontinental title. Forgot about that. I forgot that, that it was supposed. To. Gulak. There we go. And that should go right after the match. Continue show. Hey! That's what I meant to have happen. Okay, okay. 51. That's solid. 59. The figure podcast boys win, win the tag team titles. Cool. And our main event, Eric Rowan wins. Rowan's. Rowan wins our world title. Why is Brian Myers a fucking road agent? Thirty-eight increase, one decrease. Five stars. Uh, good performance for Eric. I can compliment myself. Uh, I'm gonna give Drew a hug. He deserves it. And 
good performance to Chris Hero. Wait, Eric Ron should be told that they could do better. Hold on. No, he was off his game, so he can... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. Uh-oh. Why uh-oh? Bash at the brewery. Feedback has been decent. That's fine. Oh, Walter is no longer in Imperium. Walter. Company of the Year is WWE. Highly Park and Rusher team. Candy versus Havoc is match of the year. That's show of the year. All right. Well, that'll do it for this stream. I'm going for three hours. It's kind of short, but still, I gotta go. Um, thank you for hanging out. This will be on YouTube, so if you're watching this on YouTube, follow me on Twitch. If you're watching this on Twitch, subscribe to me on YouTube. It's fairly simple. Follow on the other one that you're not on. Alright, so thank you guys so much. I hope to be back with the stream. Miles says hi to the YouTube people. Uh, that'll do it for this video. If you enjoyed it, leave a like. Let me know in the comments. And it was super fun. Thank you, Miles. And I will see all of you on YouTube and whatever I upload next.